G'day guys, Holy Critics signing in with a very special episode of Quick Reviews. Now, just recently, I crossed the 30,000 subs milestone on the Jesus Wept channel, which I think deserves a celebration, don't you? And what better way to celebrate than with the man, the myth, the legend, Brian Dennehy. Yes! <laughs> So, I picked him to star in Saturday's feature presentation, Midnight Movie. I admit it sounds rather generic, but it's a really puzzling erotic thriller that will keep you guessing right up until the final twist. So, Dennehy plays a smug American film producer named James Boyce. He's living in the UK with his bimbo wife Amber while his next big picture is being shot. Bizarrely, however, he takes up residence in a spooky country manor once used as a horror B-movie set. It's not a good choice in the best of times, but even more so when you consider Amber's fragile mental state. From the outset, it's obvious that she has some type of multiple personality disorder and needs urgent psychiatric help, but James remains oblivious. During a dinner party, it's revealed that her mother, Mandy Mason, was the lead actress in a cult classic entitled Smokestacks, which was filmed in the very mansion they're living in decades earlier. Coincidence? Maybe. But it gets even stranger. Mandy died under mysterious circumstances not long after filming Wrapped. Enthralled by the story, James's associate Henry begins investigating for himself but it doesn't take long for his curiosity to evolve into an obsessive infatuation with Amber. The line between reality and fiction blurs as she morphs into Mandy's lustful femme fatale character from the movie. It all seems like fun games until a body is uncovered in the garden. If by this point you think you figured it out, just wait until the surprise ending. With twists and turns to be had, Midnight Movie has more than a few tricks up its sleeve. Perhaps too many for my liking, but it's entertaining nonetheless. Dennehy is the strength of the movie, with his expressive demeanour and comedic sarky touch. He's a class above everyone else, which I'm sure is no surprise to most of you. I've seen a few TV movies from the Screen 2 BBC series which this belongs to. Some hit and some miss, but to be fair, Midnight Movie probably lies somewhere in between. That's why I've given it a final rating of 2.5 Halos out of 5. Make sure you check this one out, even if it's just for the novelty of watching Brian Dennehy interact with other British actors. It's almost as weird as seeing Sam Elliott in Australia. Almost. Alright guys, thanks for sticking with me for the past 38 episodes of Quick Reviews and being part of my 30,000 strong following. It's been a real pleasure so far and your support means everything to me, so please continue to get behind both channels. God bless, stay safe, and this is Holy Critic, signing out.